Hi, welcome to Storytime with Gigi. I'm so glad you're here today. Today's story is On the Night You Were Born by Nancy Tillman. And today's story is for all of you. On the night you were born, the moon smiled with such wonder that the stars peeked in to see you and the night wind whispered, life will never be the same because there had never been anyone like you ever in the world. So enchanted with you were the wind and the rain that they whispered the sound of your wonderful name. The sound of your name is magical one. Let's say it out loud before we go on. You. It sailed through the farmland high up on the breeze. Who in the world exactly like you? Who, who, who? It's the owl asking. Over the ocean. See the dolphin? And through the trees. until everyone heard and everyone knew of the one and only ever you. Not once had there been such eyes, such a nose, such a silly, wiggly, wonderful toes. In fact, I think I'll count to three so you can wiggle your toes for me. One, two, three. Did you wiggle them? When the polar bears heard, they danced until dawn. From far away places, the geese flew home. Here they go. The moon stayed up until the morning next day. There he is. And none of the ladybugs flew away. So whenever you doubt just how special you are and you wonder who loves you, how much and how far, listen for geese honking high in the sky they're singing a song to remember you by. Or notice the bears asleep at the zoo. It's only because they've been dancing all night for you. Or drift off to sleep to the sound of the wind. Listen closely, it's whispering your name again. If the moon stays up until morning one day, or a ladybug lands and decides to stay, or a little bird sits at your window a while, it's because they're all hoping to see you smile. For never before in story or rhyme, not even once upon a time, has the world ever known a you, my friend, and it never will, not ever again. Heaven blew every trumpet and played every horn on a wonderful, marvelous night you were born. Wonderful, marvelous you. You are so unique. All of us are. The story is really special. It lets you know that each one of us is, in a, is an individual. What makes you special and such an individual? I want to know. Tell me in the comments below. Also tell me what story you want me to read at Storytime with Gigi. 
and make sure you subscribe so you never miss a story time. And until next time, as my friend Les Brown would say, shoot for the moon, because if you miss, at least you'll land amongst the stars. Bye!